perfect. It's time to play Do Ghosts Exist? Da da dum, ba da dum, ra ba bum, ba da dum, wham. Fingers on buzzers. Being in this show yeah. has not added or taken away anything from my beliefs. I have quite firm beliefs that there is more <laughs> than just this. We are not just bodies, we are energy, and there is more, way more. And um, we might not understand fully, but I do believe in a higher power. <laughs> um, I'm afraid to tell you that I'm a bit, I'm a huge sort of ghost and horror fan, and I, and there's a seance on stage every night. And so, in answer to your question about feeling any sort of supernatural vibes, nothing, nothing yet. And I'm, and I want there to be, and they're not happening. <laughs> This one, <laughs> I'm bringing him along for that raid because... Yeah, I mean, there's two different camps, aren't there, with this kind of stuff. I'm definitely in the cynical camp. Um, I, I find it's... I, I, I do think that I wish I wasn't, though, is the honest truth. I, don't, I think I'm in... So you're I'm in yeah, I'm in the boring camp. I know that. I think I'm sceptical but open-minded when it comes to supernatural stuff. So um, when I did the show a year and a half ago, we were in the Noel Coward Theatre. Now apparently that theatre is haunted. I'm sure a lot of the Western theatres are. But they used to, apparently used to, the ghosts used to walk across the stage and then walk into the dressing room at the bottom, which was Lily Allen's dressing room, which was fine. I kind of feel like if like if it's like a, a music thing, we're the ones without rhythm. We can't just get we can't just go with the flow and feel our way through it. I agree. Um, but the problem is, I think they're all talking nonsense, so it's very hard for me to go along for the ride. <laughs> well, we'll see. I'll see you on the other side. Yeah, all right. But if that's true, I can see only one possible explanation. There is a ghost. I've moved her. Ben says... You left them up there by himself. What does that mean? He says a room has a field. It's what I think. Well, then that's why he said it. It's cosy in the echo chamber. What are you doing? Putting the crucifix up. Well, that was his idea. No, mine. So I did do a ghost hunting experience many years ago. That has since become quite a bit of a, a meme. Have you seen it? <laughs> Where I say tap, no, are you allowed to swear not. on this thing? Where I say tap the f***ing table. How do you mean? There have been moments in rehearsals where I've, I've done it just for the laughs. Um, <laughs> yeah, it is. There's it, a moment in the show where I'm like, I know what some of my supporters in the audience are thinking. I'm thinking about Phoebe. I need to protect her. The only thing she needs protecting from is you. I'm oh, sorry, I, I didn't mean that. Jenny, what? Listen, I feel incredibly lucky to have made my debut doing 2.22 a year and a half ago with Lily Allen. Um, just an incredible performer, incredible actor, you know, it turned out, turned out to be. And uh, yeah, what an honour to get to do it again with Cheryl. Um, and it's exactly the same thing, you know, she's been in the entertainment industry for, you know, so many years, same as Lily Allen, and is just a consummate professional and, uh, and is actually brilliant. So. Um, yeah, what a pleasure for me, you know, someone who's been acting for so many years and to be able to have that experience is, uh, yeah, it's great. And I think audiences are going to be genuinely surprised and taken aback and delighted at uh, her ability. So, uh, yeah, I look forward to everyone's reactions. Um, don't get us wrong, there's a healthy or was a healthy amount of nerves um, going into the play, but I've actually just had so much fun and enjoyed doing it so much that it's overridden any fear. I wouldn't say it's fear, I'd say it's excitement. It's hard to be terrified when, you know what you're, when you're good at what you're doing. And I think that it, all of us around Cheryl realised early on that this wasn't going to be uh, uh, trying to help someone get to a bare minimum standard situation. That um, Cheryl's got amazing instincts um, that <laughs> sometimes make me go, oh, <laughs> I'm meant to be the experienced one. I've got to keep up. That's the truth. Honestly, it's like, oh, like, like it's not even God's honest truth. Are you okay? Get away from me! <laughs>
It scared me when I saw it, though, when I saw Jake's acting. <laughs> Thank you. In 2021. <laughs> Terrifying. Thank you so Thank much you. for talking to me today. Thanks. Really Thank you. Day. And if you're there, just tap the f***ing table. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Cheryl. Thanks. Thank you, Scott. Thank you.